544, a very pink Legally Blonde the musical. It's playing this week at the Kravis Center in West Palm Beach. The production blows up stereotypes of sexism, snobbery, and scandal while Elle Woods pursues her dream. Okay, this morning our T.A. Walker shining a light on the production's wardrobe and its biggest star, Bruiser the Dog. So guys, this is really cool. We're backstage. The front of the house is that way of the Kravis Center. And Legally Blonde is the Broadway production that is here right now playing through May 21st. I'm here with Sophie, who is the owner of Somebody a Little Adorable. Yes, I'm the owner of Hazel, who plays Bruiser Woods, Elle's dog in the show, Elle Woods' dog and companion. And I have to imagine that I've seen animals in Broadway productions before. and Anything that could go wrong probably does. Absolutely. There's definitely been some mishaps that happen, but Hazel's a professional, so she takes it all well. And I love the iconic hoodie. Yes, this is like one of her first looks in the show. Um, it's her jumpsuit. Um, it's giving very like juicy couture velour jumpsuit. And who designed that? John Beltry, our costume designer. Uh, and it's so weird. He happens to be right here. It's not, it's like we planned it. Uh, hi, John, how are you? Now, these are some of the wardrobe items, or these are some of the the, the, the props. These are not actually your wardrobes, Absolutely, right? yeah. But you, I was just looking at like a gazillion things for Elle to wear. What was it like uh, making these iconic outfits? Oh, it was so much fun. I mean, looking at the original movie and then taking inspiration from that and then looking at some of the per current pop culture references and then putting that together and then working with the amazing Hannah, like we all came together. It's a big collaborative thing and it was so much fun coming together and just playing kind of dress up. With yeah. Them. Yeah, it was so much fun. Absolutely. Now I notice everybody has a lot of hair here on this show and I'm, I have made a ruling that's not acceptable. So what do you have for me? I have this wig that we had on one of the aisles before. So okay. Get the is. two finger. Oh, you got it? Yeah. You got it? I, I, nope, nope, I, I lost it. Oh no! I, I forgot to do the two fingers even though I said it. There you go. There How does it is. look? You are blonde. <laughs> <laughs> I think I would be blonde if I was a color, but it's gray now. Back to you guys in the studio. So you are working it this morning. Thanks, TA. <laughs> you think you'd be blonde? I think TA would be a redhead. I don't know. It's this kind of feels like the I, right I'm thing. I'm with you on that one. If you have something you'd like to see a shine a light on, reach out. Send us an email. Shining a light, WPTV.com. I used to love that movie, Legally Blonde. I mean, there's not very many movies that I'd watch over and over. Oh, yeah. Ashley and Jennifer, that's one of them, though. I still yes. love it. You know, it plays on repeat on cable a lot, and all the, I, I just stop and watch it every time. Even if it's just like 10 minutes, it gives you a smile. <laughs> I love I love that movie too. It's so bright and it's so it's, you, it's an in inspirational movie too. <laughs> yeah. You think about it. All right.